Hello everybody. I hope you are all having a lovely morning. I am just going to begin setting up my stream as usual. Okay. I'm really excited for today's stream. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. I just want to make sure we are good to go. Okay. There we go. Let me make sure my audio is good. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> okay. All right, so I, I'm i going to go ahead and begin. <laughs> I, I want to wait for a couple people to join, but I don't have a ton of time today. So... I am going to go ahead and start. Okay. Once again, I'm reading chat on my phone. I needed more, <laughs> I need a better way to do this, but right now it's on my phone. But anyway, hello, my lovely, beautiful Neo friends. Hey, Meemin and Dreamin, what's up? <laughs> Thank you. Uh, yeah, today's stream is going to be really super awesome. I'm super, super excited. Again, we're talking about Neopets. I'm still very much fixated on this website. And there's a lot of new stuff on this site that I was totally flabbergasted by because I just haven't played in so long. And so seeing all of these new additions, I'm like, holy moly, this is crazy. And one of the most no noticeable things, of course, are the addition of different paint brushes that, you know, did not exist when I was a kid. And so I've just been, you know, looking through different paintbrushes and I was thinking about making content, like maybe making a tier list of different paintbrushes. And I was looking at the toy paintbrush recently and inspiration struck because I just was looking at it and I was like, you know, I have so many ideas. I mean, for, first of all, first of all, I love the concept of having a toy paintbrush. I think that is brilliant I whoever came up with that is amazing love them and I do love a lot of these designs but I also feel like a lot of these designs are kind of lackluster and I wanted to talk about it I wanted to go through and rate all of the different neopet designs <laughs> uh yeah all the different neopets that can be painted into a toy style I wanted to go through make a tier list and then just spout out my ideas that immediately came to me when I am looking at some of these because it's crazy some of them are so great and some of them are so lackluster and I honestly I feel really bad saying that because I, I am I can't do digital art. I can draw, I can paint, I can whatever. Digital art, I'm like very much a beginner. So in terms of like the way these look, I think they look great. I think that, you know, it's well, <laughs> it's a very, they're all very well executed designs, but ah, just some of the, yeah, the, the ideas behind them are just not my favorite and I just saw so much potential for some of these so that's what we're going to be doing today we're going to be going through all of these toy neopets and 
rating them in this tier list that I made. And then we are going to also be talking about what ideas I had when I looked at each one of these. And some of them I don't have an idea, right? (laughs) But some of them I'm like, holy shit, like this needs to be better. And the Neopets team is going to want to hire me after this because honestly, I think some of my ideas are amazing. I know it's tooting my own horn a lot, but I just, I'm just flabbergasted that nobody thought of some of the ideas that I had when looking at these. So let's go ahead and get into it. I also might be doing, if I, if I finish this up in a timely manner, we can do my dailies at the end, but For now, we're just going to be rating the Toy Neopets. So let's go ahead and get into this. So first we have the Toy Akara. And looking at this, I think it looks really cool. I think it's a very cool design. The colors are beautiful. The marbling effect going on is very gorgeous. I'm very, I, I like it a lot. Would I paint my Akara this color? Probably not. Just because it doesn't like inspire me. And then if I were to look at this and think like what is the theme of this Neopet? I have no idea. Now that I'm looking at it closer, it kind of reminds me of like those jelly bags that were full of liquid. And when you mix them up, it would kind of have that marbly effect. And... I can kind of, it kind of looks like that. I don't know. I have no idea. I don't know what this is. I don't know. So when I think of toys, like there's just so many possibilities to be had with toy, a toy paintbrush, right? This one, I mean, a cars remind me of Furbies. So that was my first instinct. Like, oh, do a Furby thing. But I think they did a Furby thing with the Van de Geyer, which we'll get to at the end. So, okay, I get that they didn't do a Furby thing because it's, like, not a bird-type Neopet. But, like, why not do, like, a Princess Fernie Poo, Fernie Poo doll type thing? Fernie Poo. Is that how you spell that? Yeah, like, here she is. But make, make it look like... A fuzzy doll like give some texture throw this dress on her throw the crown on princess 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 fernie poo doll bing bang boom it's a it's great i love it i think it's genius i mean i'm i'm <laughs> i'm very much full of myself today holy shit but i think that's a great idea it is a moment of fan service princess fernie poo is a well known character on the site we don't really see her very much so having an homage to a character that's part of the neopets lore or at least she i don't know she plays cheat what, what's her deal i think she disappeared uh no okay she yeah she's just like a cheat champion but every a lot of people play that game look at this Look at that. I mean, she's iconic. She is beauty. She is grace. They should have made her into a Princess Fernie Poodle. Duh. Hello. Yes. So, as a design, it's not bad. I don't hate it. I do think it's supposed to be one of those jelly bag things. I don't know how to explain that. And also, I I think like you'd really have to look at that, look at this design to understand that is what this toy is. And I I could be wrong because I can't even describe what I'm talking about. But it's like some dollar store toy filled with liquid, I think. Stanger and... I'm sorry, I can't pronounce your name. Stanger... And fan fiction. I'm just gonna call you fan fiction, okay? Fan fiction said, I don't know, I think it's a lot better than 99% of the other Neopets plastic Neos. I feel like they could have done better, but it's a lot 
but it's a lot better than like the plastic ones. Yes, I agree. So for that, I think I'll put it in B tier. <sighs> yeah, B sounds good. B sounds good. B sounds safe. B sounds, yeah. So this is a B tier for me because I do like the colors. I'm not really mad about it, but I wouldn't, again, I wouldn't paint my Neopet this color if I had an Akara. I would not. So for me, that's a B. And if I were, if I am intrigued enough by the design to be like, oh, one day this might be an option for me, that to me is S or A tier. So, okay. You just, <laughs> fan fiction said the Aisha one is hideous. I'm sorry if that's like not your name. I just, I can't, I can't pronounce your name. So, but yeah, the toy Aisha you said is hideous. Okay. So let's move on to the toy Aisha. <clears throat> hideous? I wouldn't say it's hideous. I I like the purple. I like the plastic idea. And again, the the idea of having like a plastic bodied Neopet with hinges, that is obviously a toy. Duh. Love it. However, this does this idea is reiterated again and again and again to the point that it's very stale where Again, I'm just very disappointed because toy is such a cool idea. Like if I were to design a toy Aisha, I look at an Aisha and I think littlest pet shop. Okay, the fucking uh, bobbleheads. No, what is this? Why? I don't know what's happening. Okay, littlest pet shop. This is very nostalgic for me, but you know, those slightly squishy bobbleheads with the matte plastic they could have done like a nice matte finish on the Aisha done whatever color they wanted really gone you know maybe made her look like a regular cat given her the markings of a regular regular cat like a littlest pet shop toy and then given it a nice matte finish and made her head slightly bigger so she looks like a bobblehead boom beautiful this design I I really like Aisha's and I think this looks nice I like the color I'm I think I'm gonna put it in B tier I'm not super mad about this one but again I would have loved like a little pet shop bobblehead I think that would have been perfect for this one so it's like a missed out opportunity and I know yeah I know it's like you don't want to Maybe Neopets was afraid of copyright issues, but like, I mean, bobbleheads are not <laughs> solely owned by Littlest Pet Shop, so they could have done a bobblehead thing anyway, just made her head a little bit bigger, boom, and it makes a big difference to fans. I think people would have really, I mean, I don't know, it's a, when you think toy, what, like, I don't know. I don't know, but I'm gonna put this one in B as well. I'm not super mad about it. There's some other ones that I'm really mad about, but the Aisha I'm not mad about. The Blue Maru, I'm a little mad, okay? It's so boring. Again, shiny plastic, hinges, but you can barely see the, do you call that hinge or do you call that, uh, what's the word? <laughs> Joint? Joint? Yeah, like a ball jointed doll. I'm just gonna call it hinges, I don't know. But it's just very, it's serving nothing. It's serving nothing. I get nothing from this at all. And I'm pretty sure there's like punching boxer kangaroo toy. When I saw Bloomeroo, I was like, okay, like this. Hello, hello, look at this throw, take our boy, where's our boy, where are you, take our little boy, throw some, put this little winder thing on the side, give him, give him some boxing gloves, and he's good to go, everyone would eat that shit up, and even if they didn't, at least it's giving us some variety, like this, this is what I thought of, this is what I thought of, this candy kangaroo box thing, because, like, the blue maroon is kind of like a kangaroo, you know, whatever. This is what I thought of. This is what I thought of. Look at this. Look at this. 
This would have been perfect. Even making him brown with red gloves, people would people wouldn't have. I think this this image is ingrained in my brain to some degree because being a child, I've seen these boxing kangaroos. I think looking at that, people would immediately recognize it, and I think that is very powerful. And I would have loved that. So this one, I'm pretty sure I'm putting it in D tier because it's just like literally nothing. I don't like it. I don't like the color. No, I'm sorry. Again, I'm sorry to the artist who made these. I think that you're fantastic, but the ideas are just not there for me. However, Toy Bori. Adorable. And very, very unique, very original, very... Ah, I just, I wouldn't have thought of this. I wouldn't have thought of this. This is a toy. When you look at this, it, you're like, oh, you instantly recognize that xylophone toy that babies play with. It's so charming and cute. He's holding a little bone in his mouth. I would not paint my, I don't like Boris. I would not paint my Bori this color, but I want to give this S tier for effort because this is just awesome. Love it. That's what I'm talking about. I feel like more, obviously not all of the toys can be that <laughs> recognizable and I want to say emblematic, but that's a bit dramatic. That's not what I'm talking about. But you know, like you see it and it makes you think of something in the real world. It's very recognizable. Boom. Love it. Would I paint a Bori this color? I don't know. I wouldn't even own a Bori. So yeah, but okay. Toy Bruce. Toy Bruce. This one I actually really like a lot. I think the colors look very nice on the Bruce. I love the little bow, but I can't tell what toy he's supposed to be. Obviously, I, I mean, I imagine it's some kind of plush, but his feet look kind of rubbery. So I'm wondering if I'm missing out on this. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't really know what he's supposed to be, but I do think he looks very good, and I think there's more effort put, put in, and he's not plastic. So I think I'm going to put him in A tier. I just, is he a beanie baby? Is that what he's supposed to be? I mean, he looks, he looks very cute. I like this one a lot compared to all the plastic ones. So Toy Chia. Ooh. I don't... I like the effort. The battery compartment is very funny. And I like the mohawk. And, but like, what is he supposed to do? Like, is he gonna, is he a punching toy? I don't know. I, I like the idea, but it's lacking intention for me. And that's okay. I'm gonna put it in B tier. I think, uh, no, maybe C. I just don't like Chia's. I can't put it in B tier I with these two. I don't like Chia's. I'm sorry, but that's not the fault of the designer. That's just the fault of whoever created Chia's. <laughs> okay. So, hello, we have more people in the chat. Hello, everybody. Uh, fan fiction said, I wish we could get a bouncy spring toy for Bloomeroo. Yes, exactly. There's so much potential to have. So, I don't know. There's just so much potential for all of these. But, yes. Smitty said that the Bruce looks like a pinata. He kind of does, and I kind of like that. So, yes. I, I, oops. I still think that A tier is a good place for the Bruce. So, let's move on to the Chomby. I, okay, you know, dinosaurs are very much, <laughs> like toy dinosaurs are very much produced in this style with the, you know, plastic joints and all that. So it suits the Chomby better. I really like the color and I love the spikes at the end of the tail. It literally makes it look dangerous, like the toy is about to be recalled. And for that... I'm going to put it in B tier because I would not paint my pet this color, but I appreciate the effort. I wish he, if he looked a little bit edgier, that would have been more fun for me. 
because I think toy dinosaurs can be very edgy and kind of scary looking. I think that would have been very cool. But moving on, Psy Bunny. This is a big no. Big, fat, motherfucking no. Are you kidding me? Psy Bunnies are fluffy and then they made them plastic. Or is it supposed to be rubber? But it has like the the hinge points, like the other toys. But the the line work is still implying that this is gonna look fluffy. And that is just very weird to me. I don't like the colors as well. They should have made him into one of those little like what are those? Those little little bunny hop toys. Uh, bunny hop like I think you wind them up and then they jump oops not shopping okay or just I mean look at this look at this do a cute little pastel fluffy Easter moment that would have been so cute but what am I thinking of I want let's do wind up bunny toy Yes, like this. And then do the little wind, like the little crank on the side. Yes. I mean, I know that, yeah, like this. This. This is what I'm talking about. Why didn't they do this? How can you look at a side bunny and in the context of cr making it into a toy, how do you not think of this? I mean, I'm sorry. I feel bad. I don't like being, I'm not trying to be mean, but like this is just instantly what comes to mind. Instantly. Yeah, Smitty said zero effort on that side bunny. Zero effort. There's no effort at all. I'm sorry. And the color palette, come on. What is this? bright red with macaroni and cheese yellow per royal purple and then this like electric blue what is going on no no f goodbye f tier i cannot i'm sorry uh all these need to redesign please neopets i don't i don't know if they, if they've ever actually redesigned paintbrushes before but this one needs to be done Sai bunny pisses me off i can't do it i can't there was like zero effort zero research zero inspiration zero <laughs> zero love of god i don't know there's just nothing there <sighs> okay the drake love the color scheme love the color scheme it's subtle it says dragon and we have these nice ball jointed areas on the tail a little hinge on the jaw the wings are fine i kind of wish that there were hinges on the wings maybe this one's not bad it looks like a dragon toy great I'm not mad at it. What do dragon toys even look like? I'm not dragon toy. Let's see. Yeah, it kind of looks like this. Very nice. I dig. I like it. It works. I I wish it had like, like see how on this one the plastic is a little bit shiny. I wish that was seen here a little bit more with a little bit more texture just to make the design pop a little bit because I feel like in the areas around the ear and the face it gets a little bit muddied and I feel like if it's a scaly dragon toy it would have more light reflecting off of it but I think this is a good one I think that I will put it in A tier I'm would I paint my Drake this color? Maybe. It's not like S tier for me. Yeah, but it's good. I, I like it. I'm not mad about it. <laughs> Smitty said, sorry, Toy Sai Bunny, you have to repeat the grade. <laughs> yeah, for real. Okay, Toy Elephant. Elephant. I mean... 
to be fair, you don't have a lot to work with with the elephant. It's a lumpy, weird design. I think you should have just scrapped the whole thing or made it look like a nice, gray, soft, plush-looking one. And I know that they already have a plush paintbrush, but the thing is, fans would not be mad. Fans are not going to be mad about having more plushy-type options, okay? And plushies are a very important part of the toy ecosystem, okay? I, when I grew up, I loved plushies. If I went to a toy store, I would buy a plushie over anything else. So I think a lot of people feel that way. Children love soft, cuddly things. It doesn't have to be plastic to be considered a toy. And this is just lazy. It's literally just the Neopet in this pink plastic look with the hinges, and it's getting an F. But before we give it an F, let's look at, let's just Google toy elephant and see if we can get some inspiration. Okay, we have this nice, gorgeous plush. This is what I'm talking about. I, when I think of an elephant toy, I think of a nice, soft, gray plush. Look at this. Look how adorable that is. Imagine this texture placed onto this guy. He would look so adorable. Like, let's be real. Okay, other elephant toys, like the rubbery plastic, it's not really singing to me. I'm not feeling the love. But this nice, soft, gray baby toy elephant, love that. So this is getting an F. Rotten hell, you ugly bitch. Okay. Okay, toy flotsam. It's another miss. It is boring. It's, ugh. No, no. And while we're talking about the fl flotsam, is it flotsam or floatsam? I don't know, flotsam. While we're talking about the flotsam, let's talk about the jetsam. Because I think the jetsam is great. It is an inflatable pool toy. Love it. Love, love, love. However, if I were in charge of this paintbrush, if I were the creative director, I would have made Jetsam into a shark torpedo. Okay, motherfucker, look at this. Are you kidding me? Y'all had these when you're growing up, right? You throw it in the pool and it goes and it looks like a shark amazing this design is great i love the effort i love the execution however i would have preferred if the flotsam was the pool floaty and the jetsam was a shark torpedo does that mean i'm gonna give the jetsam a poor score absolutely not but i am gonna give the flotsam a bad score you you can go in d tier with bloomeru just because i feel bad for giving two people f's and i'm an i'm a nice i'm a nice person okay uh, okay the gallert i'm not mad at this one i really love the addition of the springs it's an it's like a, a unique idea that fits with the design of the Gellert. And because of that, I'm not as mad about the plastic pieces because it kind of looks cohesive. You can imagine it's like a little plastic toy with springs and that is way more interesting than these boring ass plastic toys that we've seen so far. So yeah, I like this one. I'm gonna put it in A tier because it has some originality, but I just don't, I don't know, I, it's not S tier to me. It's like almost S tier, but I don't feel like I would, mm, is it S tier? Is it S tier? After we're done looking at all of them, I will maybe come back and reassess, <laughs> okay? But for now, A tier is good. Norbu. Oh my god, I love the concept, but the execution 
is just not my favorite, but the idea is really, really good, and I really, really like, I like the idea a lot. I wish the colors were, like, I wish the texture maybe was a little bit more fine on the whole piece instead of like really big here and really small here. I wish it was kind of like this medium size on the whole body and maybe some finer pieces up here. I just, I want to really like it because I really like the idea. I just don't like the pet very much and I don't like the colors. So I think I'm gonna put it in B. It really deserves an A, but I'm biased and I don't love Norboos. So it's going to go in B tier, but it's, I like the, the originality is there. I like that a lot. Toy Growl. Color scheme, love. Tiger stripes or whatever you want to call them, love. I think he looks great in this color. And there's like a teeny weeny battery compartment on the back. I like that a lot. But again, it's a little bit stale with the same old plastic toy look but it is a little bit shinier than some of them I do think there was more effort put into this one and so for that I will put it in B tier okay I, I do I like the colors a lot I really I like the color a lot okay Grundo okay I'm not mad at this one I'm not like super mad but do you guys remember those like toy ufos where it's like a little ufo and then there's like a little bubble and then on the inside there's a little tiny guy and you always really want to get the little guy out and play with him but you can't because the whole thing is sealed together that's what i thought of when i thought of toy alien and i wish they had done that here just like literally draw like it could be a wearable draw a ufo around the grundo his little head sticking out and then there's a bigger bubble around his whole head and then he's stuck stuck in there forever and you can't get him out and it pisses you off i think that would have been so much better i don't know there's just so many ideas for a ufo toy like kind of like this guy yeah like this Ooh, this would have been hilarious to have a cow underneath oh my god or even like like this kind of maybe or like this this is exactly this is it the big round saucer his little head sticking out and then a bubble on the top oh my god that would have been so cute and also this toy is very is this a dog toy that's so cute okay anyway uh, and i like the space suit i like that it looks kind of more like it looks like plastic but it's like a softer more matte plastic i can appreciate that so I think he will also go into B tier. He's not bad, but I just, as you can see, we just don't have a lot of fun stuff to work with so far. It gets a little bit better as we go along, but yeah. Oh my God, Smitty said, Slinky Dog, I wish the middle was a Slinky too for the, the Geller. Oh my God, that would have been actually brilliant and they should have done that and they should also hire you. We can be a team creative directors for <laughs> the paintbrushes. Okay. This is, what is this? What is this? This is doing the least. Absolutely. I'm sorry. Uh, I can't think of an idea, but it's like toy snake. What do toy snakes look like? Like those weird rubber ones, like I think of like a black rubber one with the really stupid paint, like because they're so cheap and the paint looks like shit because it's so poorly done. You know what I'm talking about? Like this, just like this, like that really shitty paint job. Like something like that is very easily recognizable. Throw some fucking texture on there. Don't just make it all shiny plastic. Make it like a matte, like I said, a matte kind of plastic maybe with shiny paint on top and more texture and or like this like with the 
the different body parts. Like, come on. What is this? This is so lazy. Ugh, D. It gets a D. D. Mm -mm. Nope. Toy Jetsum. Ugh. You just woke up one morning and you said, I have a great idea. And then this came out of your brain. And I love you for that. Whoever did this, amazing. The detail of the seams where the plastic meets and the there's like a variety of like the way the shadows look sometimes they look like very dark I don't know the line work is great the handles on the side the little plug where you blow the air like you look at this and you know exactly what it is s tier love it amazing this is probably the best one so far I cannot get over that I love it. I love it so much. I also love green tea. I'm obsessed with green tea. Oh no, the Kiko. Oh god. Is that what we have next? Oh no. No. They should have made this one into a dog chew toy because that's what this looks like. Ugh. I mean, the Kiko in general kind of looks like that. I do like the, the hair. They turned it into a spring. I like that. That's nice. But like, what is this supposed to be? They should have just made him into a marble, quite honestly. <laughs> marble toy. Oh, no, 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 no. Marble. Oh my god. I mean, this one's a harder concept to <laughs> execute for sure. They should have just made him into a marble. That would have made me happier. I hate this. What is this? What is this? No. F tier. Hate it. I don't like Kikos anyway, so I know, but no. Mm -mm. Nope. Okay, Toy Koi. We have the little wind-up key on the bottom, and I really like that a lot. Do I like the rest of this design? No, not really. But the wind up key at the bottom makes it a lot better. You think like, okay, when I wind it up and put it in water, it's gonna swim, maybe. It looks more like it would be defective and kind of like keep hitting the side of the pool, but you know, I'll give it, I'll give it B tier. We got a lot of B tiers. <laughs> Uh, okay or is it a c tier it might be a c i don't like the colors yeah and the hands look weird yeah c is better okay okay toy corbat oh it's so boring the same thing mm. i mean corbat looks good in purple i guess kind of but it's just so boring like Toy bats are kind of hard too because like, but the thing I think of is like those horrible dollar store. I, I love bats. Bats are my favorite animal. And I used to like buy those terrible rubber black bats, like the Halloween decoration type ones. Sometimes they would like have, like their mouths would be open. You could squeeze them and they'd make a sound. Like that sounds terrifying, but it kind of, it suits a bat and it suits a toy core bat. Toy bat. Oh, no, no. Why is this happening? Toy bat. Hello. What am I thinking of? Like this. Uh, maybe like that. Uh, like this kind of. Yeah. Like even making it like, you know, just make it look rubbery and you could do one solid color like that like make it all black maybe I don't know or do a little plushy oh my god why does this why does the head come off oh it's Ozzy Osbourne mm. oh, look at this ah oh. yeah there's just so like do make make Corbett all fuzzy and make his wings look really small that would be really cute or make him like this. Like just make him really jacked and hairy. But yeah, there's like, I don't have like one idea where I'm like, this is what they should have done. 
but there's a lot oh my god oh my god i used to love this guy i used to have one of these and this one. Oh, i love this one. Oh, so cute oh my god plushy core bat is there a plushy core bat plushy core bat oh look at him oh i love him oh my god that's so cute okay anyway but yeah, they could have done like a, a brown bat plush, a black bat plush, a fuzzy bat with plastic wings, right? Because toys sometimes will have random textures. You'll have like a plastic pony with soft hair, which we'll get into in a second. This one, core bat, my love, D. I should put you an F, but I like bats too much. Okay, Toy Kugra. Yes. This is so goofy looking. It looks like a fucking calico cat. It's a plush. But it's like a fluffy plush. They should have made more of these, but they didn't because they hate us. They want us to cry. Ugh, or they fired the person with the good ideas because, like, I don't know. This is such a good idea. I love this. I love this so much. And I love how fat the face looks. Like, ugh. And the tail. Oh, I love it. S tier. Let's go. Yes. Don't have to think about that one too hard. Okay. Smitty said, Corbat could have been like a skeleton Halloween decoration that you hang on the wall. I literally have a bat skeleton decoration. That would have been brilliant. But, you know, I'm not in charge yet. Maybe someday. <laughs> Okay, so what is this? What is this? Come on. What is this? Oh, somebody worked hard on this. I'm sorry. It's just so boring. It, like, at least put some patterns on. I mean, this one I think should have been a matte plastic, like rubbery looking toy. And put some like nice designs, cause like the croc is a sea monster. Like, what do, what do sea monster toys look like? Yes. Okay. Yes. Like this. Just do this. Just do this. Give us some scaly texture. Make it look like matte plastic. Some nice red design highlight. Whatever. I don't know. Oh. Make his fin bigger. Boom, boom, boom. And, you know, make it look like he can swim in the water. That would have been so cool. And this is just F tier. F. Goodbye. I don't want to look at you anymore. Toy Kiri. At least they could have made the hair look soft. So then it's like a plastic toy with soft hair. I would have put it in d tier if that were the case but it's going into f tier okay toy lenny i love the spring on the tail that's really cute he looks very whimsical i like the overall like if this toy if there was like a more of a variety of the plastic toys I wouldn't mind this one. However, they should have just made him like full rubber duck mode, like made his body into a rubber duck. Maybe keep the legs. I don't know. Something funny and stupid cuz toys don't have to make sense, right? Uh, I'll put him in C, I think. Or maybe maybe B. We'll put you in B. And the Aisha can go down to C. <laughs> Okay, okay. Okay. Who do we have next? Toy Loop. Love the idea. Do I love the execution? No, but it's cute. I like it. It looks like a stuffed toy. Yes, A tier. Love it. A tier. It's not as good as the Kugra, so we can't put it in S tier, but it gets a solid a tier i do really like that one this one toy mirka is please click okay <laughs> this is hilarious this is like one of those 
vintage toys where the ferret is attached to a ball and the ball moves around and it makes it look like the ferret is chasing the ball i like that idea a lot and so for that i will put it in b tier i don't love the execution i don't love the colors and i don't love mirkas so it should maybe get an a but it's getting a b instead mohawk <clears throat> Another great candidate for a Littlest Pet Shop style bobblehead. And they didn't do it. They just did the same old shit. F tier. Or no, no, no. We'll put it in D because I don't hate the color scheme. But it's, sh- yeah. It's bad. Toy Mincy. Yes, this is what I'm talking about. Just add a couple of more details. Just give the Blue Maru some boxing gloves. Just give the Minchi some little symbols. And it's it's awesome. I hate Minchis. So Minchi also gets a B. Because look at that ugly, hideous face. I can't stand it. But yeah, it should get an A. (laughs) It should get an A. I know it should. Okay, Toy Nemo. I actually really like the design pattern thing that's happening and is it supposed to be a plush there's like these weird lines happening on the belly that i don't i just can't tell what kind of toy this is supposed to be i really cannot and uh, i like the colors a lot and i like frogs i just Let's look at frog toys. Okay. We have lots of nice rubbery candidates. And I mean, this might have been what they were going for. And I like it. I do like the colors a lot. And I think he looks nice. But I just don't get toy. We'll put him in B. He looks good, but I just don't understand. Okay. Toy Peofin. Okay. This is really nice. I really... I played with a lot of toy horses when I was a kid. And I remember them having painted designs like this. It almost looks like a carousel. Carousel toy. Come on. (laughs) They could have given her like more normal horse-like coloring with some nice, like just stick a pole right through the middle of her body and (laughs) don't worry, the bleeding will stop soon. But come on, like, giving it like a royal, a royal kind of like high deco look. What am I? This is more of what I'm looking for. You know what I'm saying? Just like make her white, put a saddle and a big pole through the middle. It would have been perfect. Oh, it would have been so good. And honestly, this is really nice. I like the color scheme a lot. I like... It's like kind of implied that she's wearing a saddle, but it's a toy. Just put a saddle on her. That would have been such a cute wearable. I would have really enjoyed that, but they just, they didn't do it. (laughs) They almost did it, but they didn't do it. And it makes me sad. Okay. Ugh, so cute. I really like this one. Uh, I think this one... I'm going to put an A tier just because it almost works as like a carousel toy, but it doesn't really. Uh, I should, mm, yeah, the B tier is too crowded. I think it deserves A tier. I do, I like it a lot. I like the red. I like the blue. Oh my God. Uh, Somebody out there. They are a loving, kind, wonderful person and they decided to bestow us with this gift, the gift of the toy Poogle that looks like a motherfucking eye dog. 
Come on, I dog. Are you kidding me? Look at that. Look at that glorious little shithead. Oh my god, S tier. This is the best one. This is the best one. If you don't agree with me, catch me outside and meet my fists. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, no, but for real, for real, this is awesome. This is perfect. It's a throwback. You look at it and you immediately know what it is. It speaks to my little baby early 2000s child that lives inside of me forever and ever this is so perfect and for real fight me i don't care if you think that this is ugly and you hate it we can't be friends we can't okay toy how do you pronounce pitary neopads i'm just gonna google that and then see what happens Oh, it's Terry. Okay, that's fine. Um, but yeah, so let's go ahead and rate this one. This is awful. It's a bird. There's so much you can do with a bird. Okay. I mean, I didn't I didn't have a lot of toy birds growing up. Let's see toy bird. Like, put it in a cage. That would have been amazing. Or like, I don't know. This one, it just does nothing. It literally does nothing. And I hate it. I hate it. F. F. I also don't like this Neopet. The color scheme is bad. F. Goodbye. Smitty said they used their imagination for Toy Poogle. Didn't just make it shiny. Yes. Yes, that's what I'm saying. There's so much potential for toys. Like, come on. Like, you have to wake up and smell the plastic because Toy Shoy Room. It looks kind of cute. Again, I'm not super mad about this one. If this were... Like, if there weren't as many plastic ones throughout the whole series, I wouldn't be mad about it. But it's so boring, and I hate it. And, ah, uh, it's going in, mm, I guess it's going into C tier, yeah. Uh, I like Shoiru's a lot, but... It's just not, it's not happening. It's not, okay? It's not happening. And I'm going to take a teeny weeny itty bitty break and just drink some tea and look at this lovely tier list. We've gotten through a lot already and it's not even been an hour. So that's really, really awesome. So maybe I can do my dailies at the end of this. I don't know. <clears throat> but this is so much fun. I love Tier list, uh, making tier lists is so much fun. Okay. Am I ready to get back? Let me have one more sip of tea. I'm so bad at taking breaks, I swear to God. Okay. Toy Uni. <sighs> Do I even need to... Do I even need to say anything at all? I don't I don't think I do, okay? I just need to do this. Um actually maybe I need to do this. Hold on. Hello. Hello. Nice soft matte plastic. Cutie mark. Soft Hair. Come on. It's not that hard. It's not that hard. The line on the neck as well, people would see that and be like, boom, I know what reference they're making. 
And at this point, my little pony has been ripped off so many times. It doesn't even matter if you rip them off, I don't think. Like, look at this. Fake. Fake. Rip off. Hello. Okay. I get it. You don't want to put the cutie mark on the butt because then they would know. Okay. Just put it like on the shoulder or on the chest. Make it look nice matte plastic. Make the hair look soft. This looks like shit. And I... Like I said, I grew up playing with a lot of toy horses and I had a lot of fun with them and they looked so cute and this does not look like any of those toys. Why would you make something so unrecognizable and also so hideous? Like the orange with the hot pink and navy blue eyes? No. F tier. And it's just so bad. They could have made it look so cute. Oh my god, look at this gorgeous... Is this real? Is this a real My Little Pony? I don't know. But look, like this nice mint green color with the pink hair. There's so many beautiful, gorgeous, fucking pastel color combinations. Oh, and the, the way the hair looks like different colors. Oh my god. They could have done so much with the uni. And they missed out. And they should redesign it. Please redesign it. It's just, it hurts my feelings. Okay. Usul. I want to vomit. Who designed this ugly piece of shit? Now I'm being really mean, but this is not good. This is bad. This is a terrible Neopet. Who's going to pay? Who's going to buy a toy paintbrush if they look like this? Who's going to do it? Not me. Not me, bitch. Hell no. Okay. Bitch. I can't look at this. And also, which... Let's have a, a, a little pop quiz. Which Neopet has their own toy line, essentially, okay? Oh, oops. Fucking Usuls have their own toy line, okay? You could have made her into one of her dolls. Like, excuse me, beautiful bride. Beautiful Bride Usuki? Are you kidding me? Like, oh, is this? Okay, so I guess, I guess they've already like done like a Beautiful Bride costume set, but there's so many Usukis. They could have literally picked any of them and just dressed her up, basically, and people would have loved it. It's a... Like, look at this. Ah, uh, it's such a waste. It's so, it's so stupid. It's such a, it's such a missed opportunity. Smitty said hula girl Usuki would, would be perfect. Honestly, yes, any of them would be perfect at this point because what the hell is this? This is supposed, like, oozles are, like, squirrel-like creatures that look fluffy and soft, and you made them completely plastic. That makes no fucking sense at all. I can't, I can't do it. I can't do it. It's going into the trash where it belongs. It's disgusting. I hate it. Such a waste! Such a waste. I want to look at the hula girl Usuki. Wait, let's look at this picture. Ballerina Usuki. Uh, cheerleader Usuki. Any of these. And maybe like made her eyes look more, like made the Usul's eyes look more like the Usuki's eyes. And made her body more stiff, like the pose, like a little bit stiffer so she looks like a doll. 
Oh, it's such a fucking... What is this? And it's green and... Mm, bad. Terrible. Okay. Vandegeyer. Obviously, this is a Furby reference. And it looks like one of the modern Furbies. Like this. Actually, it looks just like this. So why they can rip off Furbies but they don't want to rip off other toy brands is beyond me. Ooh, what is this? Whoa, what is this? This is so cool. I love this. This is very cursed. Anyway, I love that. I want that in my house. <laughs> anyway, why can you rip off this franchise, but not My Little Pony, Littlest Pet Shop, blah, 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 whatever. Like, I just don't. I don't get it. I really, really don't. And so, <laughs> Smitty said, I don't even remember Vandegeyer. Yeah, this Neopet like barely exists in my mind. I, I like the idea. The Okay, the execution is there. We got nice fluffy texture. Clearly, the plastic on the face is plastic, so you can tell the difference between the two textures. More of the pets should have looked like this, and for that, I will give it an A tier. Even though I don't love, I don't love Van de Geyer's and I don't love the color scheme, but the effort was there. <laughs> yeah, why can't we, we can rip off iDog, but we can't rip off My Little Pony. Come on. Ugh, I don't even want to look at these last two because I just know that they're horrible. F, F tier, burn in hell. Who did this to you? I don't even like walkies and I hate yearbles as well. But they both... Why Why not at the very least, if you're going to do this boring plastic thing, if you have a pet that has soft fur, make the fur look soft instead of plastic. It just doesn't... Toys don't look like this. This is bad. Awful. Okay, I'm done. Oh my God, Smitty said a mere $230 for a deformed Furby. I didn't even look at the price. I was just looking at the <laughs> Furby. But anyway, this is the toy paintbrush tier list, okay? A lot of F and D, but a lot of B, A, and S as well. Do I need to do I need to reevaluate? <laughs> no, I think this is good. Yeah, I I think this is good. And I just wish this paintbrush was better. I love the Poogle, love the Kugra, the Jetsum, the Bori isn't for me, but I appreciate the effort. I need a toy Poogle like right now. And but the rest of them, I'm like, I could live without you. I'm, I, I don't care about your existence. It has no effect on me. I just wish that you were better. <laughs> uh, whoever is responsible for F and D tier owes reparations. Dude. I mean, they should just hire me instead. And I can be the creative director and fix all of their problems because... This is a mess. Toy is such a good idea for a paintbrush. Kudos to whoever conceptualized that. I, uh, I just can't, I can't, I can't do it. But that, that's, that's our, that's the toy paintbrush. That is my final say on this. <laughs> I'm done. I'm done. I'm so disappointed and I'm done. And let's do some dailies now. I need, I need a, what's, palette cleanser. Yes. I need to have fun on Neopets instead of feeling desperate and gross. <laughs> also, my neighbors were doing construction earlier and I think they might be coming back now. So pray for me. But we're just going to do some nice, we're just going to hang out now. We're just going to do some dailies and hang out. And if you're here for that, thank you for being here. We got 19,000 Neo points. 
and a Faranga brusicle. Oh, the brusicle. That's such a cute idea. I love that. Thank you, Bruce's, for existing so that brusicles can also exist. I don't... I wish Bruce's were cuter. Let's be honest. Okay, what do we have today? We have some money. Very nice. We have a Scorchio battle wand and a Deaver. That's cute. Okay. So I need to customize a pet, purchase an item, spin the wheel, and blah, blah, blah. Okay. So who are we going to customize today? Okay. I think for my next Neopets stream, I think I'm going to dump Starfaced into the pound. Unless somebody wants to adopt him, then please let me know. Add me as a Neo friend. Send me a Neo mail, whatever you want to do, and tell me that you want him because I, or is it a girl? Are you a girl? No, it's a boy. I, I like him a lot and he's so cute, but I just don't have any ideas for him right now. And I have ideas for these five, but he's kind of like the, the odd one out. So if anybody wants to adopt him, let me know. I'll definitely give time, you know, I, I'm not going to stream tomorrow about the pound or whatever. But yeah, if somebody wants to adopt him, let me know. If not, when I make my stream, my next stream, I will be dumping him in the pound if nobody wants him. So, <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, eh. <laughs> let's, oh my god, I love Sendow. Sendow is my girl. I love you so much. You look so cute. Let's make you look cuter. Do I have something to give you? I don't think so. I just need this for the... Oh, you look kind of cute in that. Okay. I'll leave her in that for like two days and then hate it and then take it off. Okay, so we customized a Neopet. What else do we need to do? We need to purchase an item. We need to purchase three items. That's a lot. Okay, three items. Oh, Smitty, if you want Starface, let me know. And also Neo mail me later if you, I don't know, change your mind or something. Okay. What do I want to buy? Do I want a pet pet? No. I want a more, I want a special potion. I want to buy a potion from the potion shop. Like a morphing potion. But I never, they're never in stock <laughs> ever. <laughs> uh, let's look at the clothing. Um... I don't like any of these. Oh my god, Witch Corbat shoes. Okay, buying that. <laughs> and then hopefully somebody will adopt Starfaced so that she, he, she, he doesn't lose his shoes. Okay, so that's one item. What else can we buy? We can buy... I want there to be more makeup items, but there never is. <laughs> this looks funny. I'm just going to buy this because it looks funny. Okay. Bum -ba -dum. Okay, so that's two. We need one more item. What are we going to buy? Let's buy a new Suki. Oh, flight attendant Usuki. Oh, they should have made... Mm -hmm. It's such... A missed opportunity for fan service to not make the toy usul into an usuki. I already said that before, but I just can't. I can't get over it. I'll never be over it unless they fix their mistake. But until then. Okay, we bought our three items. And now what? Haunted Woods. Let's go. Spin that wheel, baby. I I love, dude, I love the Neopets maps. They're so, so cute and nostalgic. Ooh, what did we get? Is it a, it's probably a Von Kugra plushie. Yep, or no, Von Rue. Or not Von, do we get, is Von Kugra a thing? Von Kugra. Yeah, that is a thing, okay. 
Uh-huh. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> now what? Play a game. What game do we want to play? Do we want to play Fashion Fever? Probably. Let's play Termac Roll. Why not? Play game. Easy, because I suck at this game. Ooh. The sound effects on this game kill me. I missed it. Ah. I'm, I suck at this game. Who's good at this game, honestly, though? Whoa. <laughs> okay, that's good enough for me. Okay. Okay. Groom a pet. Let's go. Let's groom. That sounds bad. Let's groom Jimmy Cocoa Puff because he's a bad boy and he's very conceited. You're welcome. Okay. And now we can get all of our prizes. Oh my god, the itty bitty dop dopamine hits from each one of these is great. I love it. I love Neopets. Thank you for making yourself more addictive so that I can have more fun. <laughs> okay, and then our weekly reward this week is a Tooth Fairy doll. I think I should be getting it tomorrow. Yeah, I don't know if this, is that worth any money? I feel like I looked this up before. <laughs> Tooth Fairy doll. Okay, maybe not worth that much. Okay, maybe like 80K, that's pretty good. Okay, so now, did I get my, I got my 20k from my quest. Yeah, okay. Whoever made quest log is a genius. We really needed this to stimulate the economy, and I, I love it because I don't have to play games anymore. I can just play food club and stock market. <laughs> okay. Aw, our tier list. Tier list of tiers. Okay, goodbye, get out of here. We're gonna, what are we doing? Oh yeah, Jelly Neo Dailies, baby. Let's see. Okay, anchor management, I always fire. <laughs> Ooh, we got a book, very nice. I like to read to Sendow. She's a very smart girl. Apple bobbing, what do we get? Wooden Corbat Bat and Ball Game. We've had a lot of Corbat items today so far. Very nice. Bank interest. Yes, please. I recently got a million Neo points. Yay! Which I know is like nothing in this game. And I could easily squander that in two minutes. But, um, you know, it's great. I love it. I'm happy. <laughs> I'm, I'm doing the food hall grind. I'm continuing. <laughs> okay. Scorched Chamato. Thank you, dead ghost guy. I love that. I love free food. Okay, I don't know what the point of this is. Do you get anything from doing this? Council Chamber Neopets. What do you get? Oh... You click on King Altador. I didn't get anything. So I guess you get a prize if you click on Al Altador. Okay. Well, I didn't get anything today. That's fine. Daily Puzzle. What is the name of the original site owner's Neopets account? I think it's this one. Oh, I'm right? Wow. I don't know how I knew that. I had no idea. But I think the original owner of Neopets is like a Scientology guy now. And that name sounded kind of like Scientology. So, okay, open the door. I don't like this one. Sendow keeps getting hurt. I don't want to do that one anymore. <laughs> okay, Forgotten Shore. Do we have any money? Ooh! 
2,000 Neo points. Let's fucking go. And while we're on Croc Island, I'm gonna check my winnings from Food Club yesterday. Oh, please, please, please. Can I have some money? Oh, yes. Thank God. I mean, that's about as much as I spent to play, but at least I got my money back. Thank God. And now I can <laughs> I can place my bets today, but I'll do that in a few minutes. Let's do fruit machine. I have horrible luck on fruit machine, but I think everybody does. Oh my god, Sundao's health is so bad. Oh, oh I got a bagus and a hundred neo points. Very nice. Thank you. Love that for me. Giant jelly. Grab some jelly very good and giant omelet makes me hungry looking at it but i don't really like eggs that much is this a marshmallow omelet ew ew okay let's see what we got Ooh, we got another book so send out can be a genius we're gonna send him again i need to name my pet pets like all of these this one's named after my cat and then none of these have names <laughs> But I've been too lazy to name them. Inspiration has not struck me. Okay, guess the weight of the marrow. I've never actually played this. Okay, uh, let's say, I don't know. I don't know. Wrong. How do you win this? Some of the games on Neopets, I remember just being so confused by everything. Okay, please heal send out. She needs to be healed. Okay, gain 10 hit points. Oh, that's good, I think, for Battle Dome, which that's another thing I need to get into. I do not know how to do Battle Dome. And yeah, I don't know how to do Battle Dome. And I need to learn how to do that because apparently you can make money and apparently it's fun. And if you are partaking in the plot or like not partaking in the plot, but if there's active plot happening sometimes there will be enemies from the plot in the battle dome and so we can all battle them together as a community and whoop some ass or something like that so that would be nice <gasps> smitty said i'm about 30k neo points from the last lab map piece and then i will be broke <gasps> dude i that's my main I, f I keep forgetting, but my main goal right now is to get enough for the uh, lab map so I can zap my Neopets to oblivion. They won't even exist anymore after I'm done with them. And yeah, I, ooh, I can't wait to get into the, oh my God, the, the lab ray. I'm so excited. That's going to be so much fun. Okay. Smitty said you can level up pretty cheap at the Swashbuckling Academy. Okay. Yeah. I just, I'm not ready for Battle Dome yet. I think I'm still working towards the lab right and then I will get into the Battle Dome, but yeah. Okay, uh, synthesi synthi Synthesizer Sam said, Battle Dome is good. You can get code stones and stuff, 15 items daily. Okay, nice. Yeah, so yeah I there's so much in this game I want to get into and I have not yet gotten into it but I'm so excited for the lab ray I I, I think I want to zap Jimmy Coco Puff he might be my lab rat but like what even happens hold on should we watch a video about the lab ray because <laughs> let's do that yeah that sounds like fun okay so we're gonna watch a video about the lab ray youtube.com and this is weird why is my stuff showing up on this browser because i'm not signed in but anyway neopads lab ray let me know if the sound is too loud for you guys pound pads fortune cookies Uh, there's not a lot of info. I thought it, like, I want to know what happens when you do it. Hello. Today is 
the day, we are going to finish purchasing the secret lab map. Before we jump into that, I do want to just okay, say Okay, she's just purchasing it. I don't want to do that. I want to do this. Yes. Okay. Oh my god, all of your Neopets are scared. <gasps> oh my god. Oh! <gasps> very cool very very cool but can okay my question with the library is like uh can it change your neopet species because i don't want to change jimmy coco puff's species oh look at that wow that's awesome but yeah i do not want to change his species but i do want to change his color. I really want a mutant squee talk. I think that is what I want Jimmy Coco Puff to become. He would also look good as a Dargan squee talk, but you know, mutant is pretty funny. So this is cool. Let's do Neopets Labre Jelly Neo. Because Jelly Neo will have all the info that we need. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Accessing lab, zapping your pet. Okay. Once you have turned the map pieces in, you will receive permanent access to the lab ray, but you are limited to one zap per account per day. You're able to zap any one of your pets on any given day. And as a lab ray does not award Neo points, you are allowed to complete the map and use the ray on multiple accounts. Do bear in mind that you must earn all Neo points to buy the lab map on your main account and then send the pieces to your side accounts. Okay. And then lab ray fortune cookies. You have the opportunity to get extra zaps. Oh, that's kind of cool, but that costs real money and I don't want to do that. Okay, possible lab ray outcomes. You could decrease or increase stats, change your pet's appearance. This is more of what I'm interested in. Change your pet's gender, change your pet's color, change your pet's species and its color to one of the four basic colors, okay? And nothing at all. Can only happen to a pet with already low stats, okay? So I guess you don't really want to use a pet that has low stats for the lab ray. Labre Logger, what is this? Jelly Neo is so in depth. I it's amazing. Okay. Okay, so this is like an extension thingy that you can log your your Labre zaps. That's pretty cool. Okay. But yeah, the Labre Labre is amazing. I really want to <laughs> I really want to get into that. Okay. Okay, color likelihoods. If the lab ray changes your pet's color but not species, every possible color for your pet species has an equally likely chance of being chosen. Every color? That's crazy. No one color or group of colors is more or less likely than any other, besides, of course, the excluded colors listed in the next section. Oh, so there are some excluded colors. Okay. Species likelihoods. Like with colors, no one species or group of species is more or le less likely than any other to result from a zap. Besides, of course, the excluded species listed in the next section. Okay, so there are excluded colors and species. Long run stat changes. I don't care. Blah, 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 blah. Doesn't change at all. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. Restrictions of the lab ray. There are seven colors the lab ray cannot turn your pet into. Baby, magma, origami, pirate, plushy, okay, quiguki, royal, and usuki. Okay, so I don't really care about any of those colors. The baby paintbrush is pretty cheap if I wanted to do that. And the rest of the colors I'm not interested in. But the magma, magma is kind of interesting. I don't know how to do that. I don't feel like reading that right now, so... Blah, blah, blah. There are four species that cannot be obtained from the lab ray, and those are Drake, Croc, Ixie, and Tonu. That is interesting. Like, Drake and Croc, I get it because they are, like, limited edition pets, kind of. Or you can only hatch a Drake from a Drake egg, right? And then a Croc, I don't even know how you get a Croc, honestly. And then a Tonu, I think, can only be 
made on Tonu Day, and then Ixi. Ixies are very common, so I wonder why they chose these for pets to be restricted from the lab ray. <clears throat> okay. There is also a pet pet lab ray, which I could care less about, but that's kind of fun, I guess, if I somehow got all the pieces, but at this point, I'm not very interested. Okay. I need some tea. Hold on. <laughs> Smitty said, why buy the Neo cow when you can get the Neo milk for free? <laughs> Okay, so yeah, I need a, I need tea in my life. Oh my god. Okay. Exclusive colors. Some colors are generally only available from the lab ray. The only other way to achieve them is under certain conditions of the annual premium species change perk or from the annual holiday dream Neopet giveaway. Ooh, Holiday Dream Neopet giveaway. That's really cool. Um, and so these exclusive colors from the lab ray are burlap, which is, let's just, oh my God. <laughs> Look at this. I want this. I hate Kikos, but I want that. Oh my God. Oh my God. The, the fluffy texture on the hair. I am dead i love it ah oh, they look so good okay oh my god the burlap cow fuck me up ah so good anyway whoever designed these you are an angel from heaven god bless you yeah so exclusive colors are burlap ice mosaic what does mosaic look like i rarely see mosaic okay it's not my favorite, but I I like the idea. I love mosaics in general. Oh my god. Um I went to Disney World in, in December and if you walk through the castle in Magic Kingdom, the whole inner tunnel is coated in these like gorgeous mosaics that depict different classic Disney princess movies. Oh my god, it's beautiful. Anyway, mosaic i do i love the idea if i got if my pet was zapped into a mosaic pet i would be a little bit sad <laughs> but you know wow the the mosaic gellert looks really really good i like this a lot but anyway so mosaic msp i think msp is only yeah only poogles can be msp which look at this bitch I mean, this is standing up. They should have left it like this. I wish they did. <laughs> but look at this. Oh, it looks so good. Oh, whoever came up with that is oh, just doing God's work. Robot. Robot is an exclusive labray color because I used to have a robot P.O. Finn on this account. Interesting. Okay. Oh, my God. Robot Kiko is really cute. Robot Corbat's kind of cool. Oh my god, Robot Kugra's so derpy looking. These are cute. I like these. Very nice. Very, very nice. And Sponge. Eh, who cares about Sponge? Not me. Uh, da, 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 da. There are a handful of caveats. Ooh. Okay, Bori cannot be zapped to ice. Okay, you can acquire an ice hissy using a morphing potion. You can acquire an MSP poogle using a magical plushie? What? <gasps> I want that. I want that. I want, I want that. Oh my gosh. <gasps> wow. Wait, what? Okay. I'm gonna shop wizard this. It might not be in the shop wizard because it might be worth more, but let's just take a look. Okay, yeah, it's probably not on the shop wizard. It's probably on auctions and stuff, which sucks, but I want it. Oh my God. 
Okay. I had no idea that there was a magical MSP plushie. That's really creepy, and that would be such a good idea for a Halloween special if I'm still playing Neopets by Halloween, which hopefully I will be. That would be so cool. Okay. Sam said the magical plushie was given out recently. <gasps> like, uh, for quests and stuff? Because, like, I want one, please. Neo gods bless me. Okay, the one use robotification zapper magic zapper majig is a no trade prize, blah blah blah, can turn your pet robot. The 20, 2018 charity corner and 2019 charity corner color it wild perk allowed a pet to be zapped to any color available at the lab ray. Okay. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Some other colors are often considered library colors because they cannot be achieved with any item, though they are also available through Fountain Fairy Quest, and those colors are Alien, Chocolate, Coconut, Custard, Chocolate, Love. I love this idea. Oh, look how cute you are and delicious. I want to eat you up. Oh my god, I love the chocolate. Oh, I want a chocolate bloomeroo now. <gasps> Look at him. I think some people don't like the chocolate pets, but I think, I mean, are you kidding me? They all look so delicious. Chocolate Drake. Oh, if I didn't love Sendow being, oh my God, there's like a crack in the waffle cone of her ear. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. I'm dead don't resurrect me do not resuscitate even oh, the cow the chocolate cow this is beautiful oh i love you i love you so much anyway <laughs> chocolate coconut i thought there's only one yeah coconut jub jub and coconut chia okay i don't like either of those goodbye custard ew garlic jelly mallow and snot Ugh. okay so yeah so these are only accessible through the lab ray is there a chocolate squee talk please god please <gasps> oh my god no you need to be a girl wait no you need clothes oh my god you look so cute i mean they could have like i wish she had a little cherry on top of her head but do i need a chocolate squee talk now fuck there's just there uh, honestly like since come since returning to neopets i've been so overwhelmed with color options chocolate poogle like i can't even I haven't even decided what I really want because there's just so many good choices. Like, look at this bitch. This is amazing. How am I supposed to choose? I need like an account for every theme. I need a chocolate account. I need a, <laughs> I need a spooky account. I need a burlap account. Like, you know, I can't, how am I supposed to choose? <laughs> okay, so that's pretty much it for the lab ray, I think. Oh, I want mutant squee talk though. I think Jimmy Coco Puff would be a great mutant squee talk, but I don't know. Anyway, I do, I want the lab ray. I want the lab ray so bad. And I just went on a whole tangent about the lab ray. <laughs> Okay, I need to do my dailies. What, what are we doing? Okay, we already got our money. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Dailies. Back to dailies. Let's do Lunar Temple. I do love the Lunar Temple. I usually get it wrong. Okay, this is literally an eclipse. Hello. So that would be, it would look like uh i think you would have a little bit of sun coming out this side but this is like the moon i don't know yeah i got it wrong <laughs> you gave me a bitten apple did you bite this did you do this why did you give this to me i don't want your 
I don't want your half-eaten snack. Okay. Smitty said snot slash fart account. No, you can have a snot and fart account. Have fun with that. I don't... Oh, I got... Okay, I got a rock that I'm going to donate. Very nice. Uh, I don't know what this is. I'm scared. I don't want to do it. Um, <laughs> let's do this thing. I never win. Ooh, I got 500 Neo points. Very nice. Okay. Rich Slorg gave me 50 Neo points. Thank you. You're so rich. I don't want to do any of these. Let's do the second hand shop though. And I don't want any of these, I don't think. <sighs> okay. Ooh, my favorite discarded plushie. Thank you. Where do you get all your money from? He gives me he gives me money like every day. We're besties. Okay, Tombola. Has anybody ever gotten anything good from Tombola? Because I have not. But it seems like everybody plays it pretty religiously. But I have yet to get anything at all. <laughs> okay. What else can we do? I want to do Fairy Caverns. Where is Fairy Caverns? Right here. Okay. I feel like I should go right. And I feel feel like I should go right again. <gasps> okay, and I feel like I should go left. Yes! What did I get? Hell yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah, bitch. Okay. Now what else can we do? Are we done? I don't think so. I could do my... I could do my I could do my food club bets for the day. That sounds good. But is there anything else? We could play coconut shy. The ugh, this used to scare me. This guy's scary and his laugh is disgusting. But good job to them for making this very disturbing. <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> Also, let, let, y'all let me know if the sound is too loud. I really have no idea. Okay. Ugh. Get out of here. You sound like a freak. Aw, oh, man. Ah, not again. Okay. I've never knocked one down. Has anybody knocked one down? I have never. Oh, the laugh. Who 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 did that? Did, is that a human being's voice? Uh I remember playing this game at night. Like, I would play Neopets at night and go into the haunted woods and be terrified of everything. <laughs> Dude, I want to knock one down. Dude, you need to take a shower. You, I can smell you from here. Your breath probably stank too. Ah, okay. Uh, that was that was fine. <laughs> I probably lost some money. I wasn't keeping track. Okay, and let's bagatelle. This game is. I d current jackpot. Ew! Look at him. How do I play? Oh. This game must be rigged. It definitely is. Okay. Anyway. 
Let's, let's do something else. Ooh, let's look in the hidden tower at the expensive things that I'm not going to buy. And it looks like, I don't know when they like change the stock, but it's been like this since I started playing again. And yeah. Oh my God, I love this. Reject, reject Fairy Queen doll, yes. I low-key want a Valentine paintbrush, but also like not. <laughs> and I low-key want a Dargan paintbrush, but also not. I could probably afford that now, or almost. That's pretty cool. And I don't want a baby paintbrush. I'm not very interested in the babies, honestly. I remember when I was, oh my god, when I first played Neopets and there weren't like a, you know, stupid amount of colors your neopet could be like baby was like top tier everybody wanted a baby neopet but now i'm not as into it let's go ahead and buy some stocks is this the bar yeah okay so always go to the bargain list everybody let's see what we can get today Ooh, let's buy this yes we're gonna buy one thousand Thank you. And this is my portfolio. And I pulled out the other day and I shouldn't have, <laughs> but it's okay. It's fine. I'm learning. Mm. Apparently you should wait until the current price becomes 60. So far, this is the closest one I have to 60, but it's not quite there yet. So I'm definitely keeping an eye on this one and yeah so that's my that's my portfolio I've sunk thousands of neo points into this <laughs> stock market oh okay so <laughs> Smitty said did you turn the lights on before going into the haunted woods no <laughs> the lights were off <laughs> okay all right, what can we do now? What can we do now? Uh, let's check Tarla's shop. I don't really know. I don't, oh. Oh. Okay, L yeah, let's buy a mystery bag, yeah. Okay, what can we buy? Let's buy the most expensive one. <laughs> Why not? Oh, <gasps> packet of gravel. Sorry, I don't know how that one got in there. Bitch, what the fuck? That is the worst pull I've ever had in my life. Can I buy another one? Oh, a couple minutes. Okay, whatever. Okay. Let's do a Judora quest and then I can do my food club thing. That will be good. Okay, this used to freak me out too. It's like, are you sure you want to help her? It's like, oh, uh, I think so. Okay, blue scallop mirror. What are you gonna do with that? I, are you even gonna do anything? I don't believe you. Why do you need this? Okay, boom. Okay, it's only a thousand neo points. Very, very good. Ooh, 500. Okay, let's open that one. Okay, I think that's good. I don't care. Okay. Oh, no. I hate my inventory. Why? How many? I have 54 items. How is that even possible? You know, we're just going to go to the shop. Go to my shop. And we're going to... We're going to stock the shop really quickly and get rid of some items. So I can buy that thing. Okay. We're going to get rid of that. And this and this and this. Maybe not that. Maybe probably that. Not the book. I'm going to keep the book. Get rid of that. Blah, 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 blah. Oop. Shiny obsidian pack of gravel. Okay, goodbye. Okay, now we're going to go back to the shop and we're going to do this again. 
Yes. Okay. Oh my god, I love that people like customize their shops. That's so cool, but I am not talented enough to do that, nor do I really care. <laughs> okay, so also thank you guys for being here as always. If you haven't added me on Neopets, please do. My username is X W E L E L E E. I don't know what that means. I was young when I made that username, don't judge me, but please add me. Let's go back to Judora's Bluff. Ah, oh, I should have walked to get it myself. Bitch, why do you do this to me? Just give me your evil dark magic powers. Why do you always shit talk me whenever I do you a favor? <laughs> but I love Judora. She is she is here, she is queer, she's in love with a Lucin, apparently. I love that. Is there anything else to do in Fairyland? I don't think so. I wish I could go to the library. I don't know how the magma pool works. I don't know how this works. Goodbye. Ooh, the Snowager, he is awake. I, I I caught the snowager sleeping one time and I got the worst prize. It was like a, a keychain or something. I was so disappointed because I was so excited. I was like, yes, he's sleeping. What do I get? And then I got nothing. <laughs> okay, so let's do our... Yeah, I'm not signed in. Yeah, okay. So this is the guide I use to do my food club bets. And recently I've been doing Garrett's bets. And today he's doing two positives, play Lagoon as a third. I don't really know what this means, but I kind of just like look at it and then I see what En Shang is doing. And I just feel it out. Okay, so last yesterday he had pretty good results compared to Garrett. Aggressive was the same and Adventurous was the same. So you know, I think we can do we'll do Garrett's again. I like his dog. And you just never know what's gonna happen. This is gambling, people. And then we're going to go to Neo Food Club. And we're going to post his string. If any of you guys want a guide on how to do this, I can make a guide. But there's already guides out there. And yeah, but if you want to see me cover it, let me know. And I'll do it. <laughs> it's very, very easy. As you can see, this is taking me like five minutes and then now all my bets are placed and let's see what our potential winnings are oops oopsie and i lost it <laughs> let's go to croc island blah 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 and current bets Okay, wow, the potential winnings for today is 5 million, which is really high. Usually I feel like it's like 1 to 2 million, maybe. So maybe our odds are good today. Or maybe I'll check tomorrow and I, <laughs> I'll, I'll, I will have won nothing. And that really sucks. But apparently you're just supposed to stick with it and keep going, so... So that's what I'm doing. I'm sticking with it. I am continuing on. I am not giving up, even though I've lost quite a bit of money. <laughs> okay, bet history. So yeah, so far from this game, I have made 372,000 Neo points, which is pretty good. I've only placed 15 bets and I have bet a total of almost 2 million Neo points, which is crazy. But that's just, that's just this game. That's just this game. You have to keep going and it's scary and horrible, but you know. 
Mm. Oh, I have a Neo friend request. Yes. Thank you, synthesizer. Oh my God, I can't say that word. Synth synthesizer. Synth I can't say it fast. Oh my God. Synthesizer Sam. Thank you. I should just talk more slowly. I think my brain always moves too fast for my tongue. But thank you for the Neo friend request. We are now Neo friends. That is so much fun. I love that. And what else can we do today? Is there anything else fun to do? Pick your own. Pick your own what? Oh, pick your own something. Okay. Berries. Okay. Ooh, jumbleberry. Okay. <laughs> There's so many weird things on this website. Super juicy berry. Ooh, it looks like a balloon. That's funny. <clears throat> like a water balloon. Okay. I found an old boot. Okay. I found a pile of dung. Oh, it's going to stink up my berry basket. Hello. Disgusting. What is wrong with you? Half eaten berry. Okay. Do I, oh, I, do I get to keep going or am I done? I think I might be done. Or do I get six? I should get six. Oh, okay. Oh, love berry. Oh, so cute. Okay. Very nice. Collect berries and leave farm. But like sometimes your inventory is allowed to go over and sometimes it's not. And I really don't understand why that happens. But you know. Mm. And the site is stalling. The site is stalling. What? Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Meridel. I never liked this part of, I don't know. I'm just not into medieval stuff. Oh, this is where Lucin is, but she's not, she's a snooty ass bitch. And if you do a Judora quest, you can't do a Lucin. So I'm going to do all the Judoras and then hopefully a Lucin will talk to me. Maybe she won't. I don't know. <laughs> I wish, like, I wish when you go to Lord Dargan's chambers, I wish something fun happened, but it doesn't. And, yeah. So, is there anything else to do? What can we do? Ooh, Igloo Garage Sale. Oh. If you want, oh, wait, wait, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> what is this junk oh my god like tiles and house stuff I you can't really like uh like neo homes aren't really a thing anymore right like I don't know okay what else can we do Wishing well, yes. Let's do this. Uh, snowager stamp. A lot of people are doing snowager stamps. So I'm going to donate 1,200 Neo points. Sure. And we're going to ask for a snowager stamp and pray that our wish comes true. Um... If the well grants your wish, it will be in touch via Neo Mail. Okay, very cool. Yeah, very nice. Okay. Neopian Lottery. Ooh. Okay. I I have so I have so many streaming ideas, and one of them is to like cover all of like the slots games. And because I, I think, I feel like I've already mentioned this on stream. I'm not sure, but I just, I love the fact that there's so much gambling in this game for children and I'm obsessed with it and I just want to blow a bunch of Neo points. So at some point I'm going to start collecting, 
a, a good chunk of Neo points to just blow on slots one day. So that, that'll be really fun. Okay, buy a lottery ticket. Okay, let's just, 34, 13, 19, 21, uh, 67, I don't know. <laughs> oh wait, one in 30, oops. Oops, I'm dumb. 29, we're just gonna do 30, no, we'll do 23 and five. Buy a lottery ticket. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. Do I, do I wait? <laughs> what do I do? <laughs> do I click this? What do I do? Do I just wait? Oh, uh, I guess they haven't drawn it yet. Okay. 4 a.m. NST. Okay. So this is just, this is just, okay. I have to wait. Okay. <clears throat> um, is there anything else to do? I don't think so. But while while you guys are online right now, does anybody, I'm just going <laughs> to offer him up. Does anybody want to adopt Starface? I'm going to put his little shoes on. Let me see. Hold on. Inventory, which Corbat shoes? Put it in your closet. Yes. Customize. If anybody wants him, I'm not dumping him now. You still have time if you want to think about it, but if anybody wants to adopt him, oh, look at him with his little shoes. Oh, he's so cute. If anybody wants to adopt this guy, he can have this nice little background. Actually, he doesn't pop out of that background. Maybe this one's better, but you can't even see that one. <laughs> oh, wait, what, did he already have that one on? Oh, he already has that one on. Oh, yeah, so he comes with all this stuff. If anybody wants to adopt him. Oh, Smitty, you'll take him? <gasps> okay, okay. Uh, do you have a spot in your in your pet slots? Because you can take him right now. Because I'm pretty sure you're in my... Yeah, this is you, right? I'm pretty sure this is you. Not to, like, blast your page on... <laughs> But I'm pretty sure this is you, right? Smitty, yeah. I can send him to you. I just I'm gonna wait in chat to I'm gonna wait for confirmation that I can send him over and then I will do it. And oh I'm so happy. I, I was really worried he was gonna lose all his clothes and stuff if I dumped if I dumped him in the pound. And Okay, here we go. I just, I just abandoned my white grundo. She begged me not to and asked why I didn't love her anymore. Oh, oh no. Okay. We're gonna transfer you. Oh, that's not, that's not right. What, what? No, no. Okay. I hate Okay, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Community Neo Friends. Okay, too smart. Copy that. And then we're going to go to the pound. Let's go this way. Uh, is it here? Yeah, the pound transfer we're going to transfer starface let's see if if you're on my yes here we go okay okay oh <gasps> yay okay confirm transfer yay okay so now he is officially once you adopt him he's officially yours congratulations and thank you for taking him and he is fully dressed up in all of his paintbrush clothes and some extras so 
take care of my little baby boy and then now I can do a, a stream where I go through the pound again because that is my favorite thing to do and I'm obsessed with I'm obsessed with pound surfing oh new friend yes thank you yes everyone add me right now I want more Neo friends and send me a Neo mail. I love Neo mail. Me and Shai Celeste have been Neo mailing and I'm obsessed. But yay, we did our first. That that's I think that's our um because I think Feels Evil adopted. Yeah, I sent Feels Evil our stinky swamp gas Shoiru guy. Oh my god, let's pound surf right now. Actually, do I have time? I have like literally two minutes. Let's just go in the pound for two seconds. Okay. I'm obsessed with pound surfing. I can't help myself. We probably won't get anything good, but just for like a couple minutes and then <laughs> and then I have to go. <laughs> Ooh, a custard norbu. No, thank you. I swear sometimes like people just go and dump their pets because I'll see one good pet and then I'll see like three more. I don't know if that's going to happen today, but it, it has happened to me a couple times. I'm going too fast. <laughs> Holiday core. <laughs> oh, Quiggles. I wish you looked better. I really do. <laughs> Okay. Oh my gosh, Smitty, if we see your Grundo in the pound, let me know their name. <laughs> uh, is this is this your is this your white Grundo? Smitty, is Grunde your white Grundo? I'm gonna die. <laughs> Pologroid Anna Fart. Okay. That's nice. <laughs> Oh, I hate children. Yeah, so we're probably not going to get anything good right now in the pound, but it's still fun to look, browse around. And let's, no, I won't check, I won't. Yeah, I am i can't, I can't stay. I, I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go now, but ah. Uh, Thank you guys for being here. This is so much fun. I love Neopets. I love making Neo friends and I love streaming. So yes, if you have any ideas for Neopets content you would like to see, that's kind of a good name. Sorry, I can't focus. But if you have any, <laughs> any ideas for Neopets content, if you have any tips about the Battle Dome, if you have any uh, tips about getting library pieces let me know in in like the comment section after I stop streaming add me on Neopets please let's all have fun together maybe we can make a guild I was thinking about that I was like what if we made a guild <laughs> just for fun but you know uh yeah I gotta go I gotta go it's time to go <laughs> but yeah, thank you guys so much for being here and watching till the end. This was a lot longer than I expected, but Neopets is just my obsession right now and I'm having too much fun. And yeah, I ha like I said, I have a lot of ideas for Neopets content, but if you have any ideas you would like to share with me, please, please, please let me know. And yeah, but until next time, I... We'll see you guys later and just keep an eye out for if you're not subscribed please subscribe if you want to see more neopets content and know when i'm going to stream and yeah but until next time which hopefully will be very soon but until then i will see you guys later bye